Here we are again, Brad. Two years, oh, actually more than two years. It was early two years ago when we did that first burger video. That was the slap happy burger video. You know, it's a perfect afternoon to fire up the Weber. It is, so, okay. Uh, don't need to. You don't season them at all, right? I mean, it's, no, that's one of the things I find really interesting because a lot of people go crazy with the drubs and the sauces and everything else. We, and well, we do use sauces, but they're applied after the burgers. They're are toppings. Right. That's right, that's right. Toppings. Yeah, you, st you still have the Elvis burger? Yes, nice. We do. Okay. Right. Nice fire. Nice fire. And it won't take long. In fact, we're not going to use your grill grates. Tonight, let's use fresh ones. Oh, good. So I'm going to take the, yeah, I'm like going to take those off. One. And, because I want to show some things too that's kind of cool that, you know, we've learned. But I'm going to also, let's just leave one off. Get okay. it fresh every day. Very cool. So you do hand patty them, like we just like you're doing? hand patty them, and they're going to be cooking just like you do on the grill because they're cooked over an open flame. And they're a little crunchy on the outside, even the rear. All right. Oh, look very at good. This. Remember last two years ago, I'm twisting and yes, turning, you and did. flipping and, and flopping. Mike Mills told me Look at this, a quarter turn. Yeah. Yep. Oh, it should be so easy at the vortex. All yeah. right, now you kept that uh -oh. one out. Yeah, and I, you know what? Do you have a spatula? <laughs> I should have got. I need this. I don't want to mess it up. Leave it to Beaver. I haven't used one of these in a long time. There we go. All Where right. Go? I think I'm gonna turn him. Uh oh. Ah. Uh... I wonder if the camera can hear that. Sounds great. No, this is the steakhouse turn here. This. Oh yeah. I love that. That is beautiful. Look at the Ooh. grill marks on there. Look at the amount of. Uh, do you hear all that juice sizzling under there? So all that juice goes into the grid, comes right back up and cooks into the meat. Absolutely. 